Folks at the Jenny Wiley State Park say they believe the outdoors is for everyone. That is why they hosted their annual impaired mobility deer hunt today. WMT Sean Berry caught up with a few of the hunters and has more. Saturday, the Jenny Wiley State Park welcomed all hunters, even those bound to a chair, proving that anyone can hunt, even right here in the mountains of eastern Kentucky. And this helps us to be able to do that and hopefully provide a service and an opportunity uh, to folks that uh, might not otherwise have one. The day was the beginning of their annual impaired mobility deer hunt, giving hunters from all over a chance to do just what they love. Yeah, you get you get pretty pumped up, you know, about it. So it's, it's cool. It's, uh, you can do a whole lot. You just gotta want it. Some of the hunters I talked to said it was their first time at the park for the deer hunt, and they said that they're grateful for that push to get them outside. I just like anything with outdoors, you know. It's something that I've always been limited to in my life, and this hunt has enabled me to be able to do it. Richard Rohr even had to show off a little for the cameras, nailing a Coke can from over 100 yards away, using a gun triggered by a tube. It's got like a straw on the other end and you sip, sip it and when you do that it pulls the trigger. And, and as fast as you can sip it, there's as fast as it'll shoot. When we spoke, Richard had yet to bag his first buck, but he says that will soon change. In Floyd County, Sean Barry, WIMT Mountain News. Officials with the program say this year's hunt was dedicated to Letcher County teen Cassie Begley. Begley attended these hunts before she died from spina bifida in October.